So there's only three parts. Fine. So in that case, in that case, all right, we don't quite have enough. All right, so we'll do. Who who identifies with low voices? Nobody else. Okay. All right, so low voices will be number three. So high voices on this side, high voices on this side, and then the low voices will take okay. take I'm the rear. So I'm going to repeat, guys. So okay, here's, here's our new page. Yeah. We'll allow it. This is a round. Okay, I think no one is saying that. This is the this is first, first entrance, second entrance, and the low voices are third entrance. Oh, we're third. Sing Noel. Okay. okay, so all together, M. <laughs> Sing Noel, sing Noel, Noel, Noel. Sing Noel, sing Noel, Noel, Noel. Sing we all Noel, sing we all Noel. Sing Noel, sing Noel, Noel, Noel. Sing Noel, sing Noel, Noel, Noel. Sing Noel. Sing it so softly that no one can hear you. <laughs> All right, so we'll do that again. All right, so we'll just start right into the round, very softly, like very sweetly. Choir boys. Repitch. <laughs> continue his tradition. Um, so I thought to introduce ourselves, instead of saying our name and where we're from or other things that we've done in the past, um, I thought it would be fun to tell a very short story, short, 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 that might be <laughs> something associated with a holiday tradition or uh, a holiday memory associated with this. So I'll tell you, I'll start off that uh, when I cleaned out my mother's apartment, we've got a, a um, a menorah that was a little music box, and um, it played Hatikva. It was a great thing that I remembered from my from my childhood. And of course, the spring had broken, and so it didn't work anymore. And we took it to a clock shop and it took them nine months to find the spring. But you know what happened? Gave birth to it. So. Okay. So um, a bunch of years ago, I got uh, uh, it was made into a DVD. You know the old uh, eight-track things that people would take Super films eight? with. Films with, you know, so of course there's no sound. Um, but it was of Christmas at my aunt and uncle's, because my uncle was Catholic, they had a Christmas tree, everybody went there, and I'm, I'm Jewish, and my father's side was Jewish. My was, anyway, so everybody running around having a great time with Christmas, and my father standing against the wall reading the newspaper. So <laughs> that's what he did. And the New York Times, Happy Times. Okay. Uh, anyway, this demonstration, um, I was maybe uh, five years old. And my father was away. He used to be away a lot doing things. And it was Christmas, and 
he wasn't supposed to be coming home, and it was, um, I woke up Christmas morning, and my father was there with oh. loads and loads of presents that he bought from wherever he had been. And that was oh, actually, it was, that's it was so great. Nice. It's like a Hallmark movie. <laughs> <laughs> Short version. I, I can't think of any anecdotes to tell about myself, so instead I will tell my very short Irish joke. <laughs> An Irishman walks out of a bar. Great. Oh. That's, oh. That's short. Oh. I got a, Jew, a Jewish joke. That's right. Just Next. Okay. I want this to be short. John, Are we late. supposed to say our name or just something? No. And, and, and we'll find out. Find I out. forbid anyone should know anybody. There was one name. Christmas when my dad wanted only blue lights on the Christmas tree. For Hanukkah. That's a, that's okay. a blue period. Right. <laughs> um, for years, when my kids were little, I would travel from Philly up to um, Maplewood, New Jersey. And the deal was we decorated the tree on Christmas Eve. I always bought sloppy joes, not the sloppy joes that maybe you think of. It's a specialty of Maplewood, South Orange, Milburn, on Rye Bridge with all kinds of stuff. And, uh, and then we would uh, go down to church, the 7 o'clock family service, and my kids promptly always went to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Which I was relieved for. <laughs> for a moment. Does it have to be Christmas? No, good. holiday. Uh, good. Um, I, uh, when I was three, Easter rolled around. I'm Jewish, but Easter rolled around. And <laughs> Easter Jewish. Okay. Fine. <laughs> and uh, and I said, the night before Easter, I said, when my mom was putting me to, to bed, I said, don't forget to leave the door unlocked tonight. And she said, why? And I said, so the Easter Bunny can get in. <laughs> <laughs> and the Easter Bunny left me a, a basket, and I found it next morning at 5 a.m. when I went down the, <laughs> down the hall into the kitchen. That's so yeah. exciting. I know, it was great. Uh, <laughs> just um, decorating the tree. <laughs> we'll come to that later. <laughs> well, I have a birthday story. Okay. When I was 10 years old, I saw this little encyclopedia, which in those days cost like $3, and I really, really wanted it. It was a, a large book, but very thin, and it was encyclopedia. And I asked my father for it, and he didn't understand what I wanted, but I got it anyway. Yeah, I got it. Wow. And I used it, I swear, I used it for about five years copying pictures out of it. It was a treasure for me. It was all $3. It was of a total course. treasure. That's Absolutely. Great. So, also Jewish, my fondest memories are being in church on Christmas Eve, <laughs> singing Christmas carols. And along with that, I had a, actually had a job in a church for which they, believe it or not, paid me. And <laughs> when people used to call my house and say to my mother, where is Phyllis? She would say, oh, Phyllis is in church. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, oh, hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> hello. Oh, okay. a, a friend always um, has this Christmas Eve party where we sing carols, and she has a book, and the last number in the book is Feliz Navidad, and right. every year I do the cha-cha with her cousin Lou, and this time I had hurt my shoulder, and I was under orders not to hurt this arm. <laughs> and I said to Lou, Lou, I don't think I can do the cha-cha with you. He says, I'll lead. You just hold with your left hand. And we did the cha-cha, oh, and we were fine. Yay. So I didn't miss my annual cha-cha oh. with cousin Lou. <laughs> And Christmas was saved. Christmas was saved. <laughs> <laughs> cha cha. <laughs> Another Hallmark movie. <laughs> I can only think of a bad joke. It's okay. He told me. So it's okay. okay. Yes. Blue period. Um, let's see. So I'll make it very short. So there are three guys, and they were all carousing at Christmas Eve, and they ended up in a an accident, they all died, went to heaven, and um, they stand before the pearly gates, and they have to prove why they should stay in heaven. And they're all just kind of tipsy. So the first one is, is being asked, what, what do you do, or what do you believe that should allow you to into heaven? And he, he reaching around his pockets, he, he 
finds his keys and he jingles the keys. He says, well, these are the bells of heaven. They say, good point. The second one, he's sweating. He doesn't know what he's going to do. And he, he finds a cigarette lighter, so he flicks and he says, well, this is the eternal flame. <laughs> Fine. And the third one, he reaches into his pocket and he pulls out a pair of women's panties. <laughs> and St. Peter looks at him and he says, these are carols. Oh! <laughs> oh my God! Oh! I love it. <laughs> um, well, one of my fond memories of Christmas time is when my sister and a girl she had gone to boarding school with um, came to New York to stay with me, and. Um, I asked if they would mind singing Christmas carols. I mean, they're not Jewish, so, but anyway, that isn't what they came to New York for, to sing Christmas carols. And so we went to John's caroling party, and we, uh, do better than that. we stood out on, the, on Sheridan Square and, and sang the carols that we had rehearsed. Uh, and they're all very different carols from the ones that are in this play, played in the supermarket. Um, <laughs> and we, we sang those carols, and it was a great time. Uh, my husband was Nor Norwegian. All his family was in Norway. And the first time I went to Norway with him was for Christmas. And it's a totally different experience there, no doubt about it. But, so I went to Midnight, and we went to Midnight Mass in this church that was born, built in the 1600s. It was a really fabulous experience. And they're singing all these carols. At that point, I did not know a word of Norwegian, but I'm sort of trying reading the, the text and following along. And I kept trying to figure out why they were singing about the Englishmen in their, in the carols, because they kept saying England. And that's, it turns out that's the word for angels. Does <laughs> 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 Boris Johnson know this? No. Every Christmas, our, our family would get together and uh, decorate a Christmas tree. There were four children and the oldest and my two parents. And then uh, after we decorated the Christmas tree, we all got to have banana splits. And we loved that. <laughs> and then we also all went to uh, St. Casimir's Church for uh, Christmas Eve Mass, where we heard and sometimes sang Kolende, which are Polish Christmas carols. They were very, very beautiful. Are you Polish? Yes. I uh, don't have any Christmas Hanukkah or Hanukkah stories with Passover. Every every Seder, um, there are four four cups of wine. Our family said it's it's not a not a Seder until somebody spills, like knocks over one of the glasses of wine, and invariably that would happen oh, pretty yes. much consistently every every <laughs> time. Right. <laughs> well. I'm of Jewish descent. My parents were both atheists. We practiced no kind of religion at home, except that I was told, if you believe, that's a crutch, so that kind of thing. However, when I was little, we had a Christmas tree with all of the lights and lots of little bit of tinsel hanging. I loved it. <laughs> and of course, Santa Claus came. <laughs> and every Christmas, we would put out a glass of milk and a whole box of cookies. Eventually, I was told that Daddy was Santa Claus, and I couldn't believe he ate a box of cookies. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Can I tell my, my Christmas joke? Mary did. It's the only please. joke I know. Oh, you did? Oh, you did? I started Mary, oh, okay. Mary and Joseph are on their way to Bethlehem. Mary is very pregnant, and Mary is riding on a donkey, and Joseph is walking in sandals, and there's rocks, and he's getting tired. And he stubs his foot and he says, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> and, Mary, and Mary says, Oh, I like that better than Melvin. Nice one there, Bob. Okay. Okay, so let's do the top one. Okay. Yeah, it's a nice it's a nice little uh, nice little duck. May God bless all those here with a very merry, very merry Christmas and a happy new year. May God bless all those here with a very merry Christmas 
and a happy new year. One more time, May God bless all those here with a merry, merry Christmas and a happy new year. Okay, so it sounds like old McDonald's. It does, it does. Okay, so this is four parts. So let's do... We can raise a little. Yeah. Okay, so let's do part one, second entrance, third entrance, and then fourth entrance. Okay, and... May God bless Let's raise it. Let's do it in unison. Yeah, we'll do it in unison. That'll be a better way to go. And. May God bless all those here with a merry, merry Christmas and a happy new year. May God bless all those here. I didn't, for those of you who are new to this group, we have various ways of ending rounds. And I'm going to show all the bad ways of doing it first, which I've just done. So there might be a gesture like this, which means when you get to the last line, repeat that so everybody collapses. But don't go to that right away. When you see when it, you just get, when you get to that, right When you get to that line. The um, little hold at the end thing is, means that we've got a chord that we're going to end on. And what Usually I wanted to do with this one. For the chord. Sometimes. You know, sometimes, sometimes. Some, that's, John, that's if John is tight to it. Um, and what I wanted to do for this, what I wanted to do for this one was to have, when you get to the end, just stop, and then when you get to the end, just stop. When you get to the end, just stop. We don't do that too often, but I was thinking of doing that there. But that was. But the fourth way of ending is just ending it with total chaos, and that's what we just did. The other reminder, the other reminder for those of you, again, who are new, um, uh, the neighbors downstairs, or sometimes the neighbors not downstairs. It's not the neighbors downstairs. It's John. Don't tap your foot. Don't, so, don't, <laughs> okay. so tap it inside your feet. Tap right. you know, your toes inside, inside your feet. Virtual, virtual tapping. Tap virtual virtual tap yeah. So just, just do that. Otherwise, the police will come and get you. <laughs> okay, right. so we're, we're, done, we're done with this page, so pass it up. We so pass them back or keep, keep them. Uh, we've done, we've that done that recently, done. so we're trying not to These repeat nice. stuff. Uh, let me have the festival. Okay, pass them. Okay. So pass this out. Did we do the last one? No, no, we, we, we've done that we the, have done it recently. more recently. That so happens to, to be its own round and its own envelope. We have a lot, we have so many we have a lot to do tonight. tonight. So we're going to do It's a we're beautiful gonna, round. We're going to sing through 2020. There you go. Um, it is a beautiful round, so if you want to sing it with other people, Thanks. keep the, keep the sweet. Okay, we need guys. some from up here. Yeah. Sarah. It's coming, it's coming. Thank you. Sarah. Uh, first note C. Okay, I'll catch you. The other thing is if you have perfect pitch, I'm too bad. Sorry. <laughs> right. Too bad, right. Because we don't do things as written. Does anybody have perfect pitch? Not today. Sometimes. 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 It's a curse. <laughs> I'll take that rather than the No, you don't want to have it. Candle shimmering, shimmering, okay. shimmering, shimmering. Do you want to lead or do you want me to? I don't care, you're up. Okay. <laughs> All right, so. Candle shimmering, 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 locker sizzling, sizzling, sizzling. First two lines. Candle shimmering, 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 locker sizzling, sizzling, sizzling. Cradle, spin, spin, spinning, 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 festival of freedom. So dreidels, dreidels, spinning, 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 festival of freedom, festival of life. Okay, so if I could read, festival of life. It's like before. That's right. What's that one? I'm listening to you. Candle shimmering, shimmering. Okay, so let's uh, let's do it a couple of times and then we'll split into five parts. A bass is asking for it to be higher. Okay. okay. So we'll raise it. Candle shimmering, shimmering. Four, 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 four
That's that's E flat. Uh, when I get to it, because we've changed the pitch. Candles shimmering, shimmering, shimmering. Butter sizzling, sizzling, sizzling. Fredo spinning, spinning, spinning. Festival of freedom. Festival of life. So that's the fourth line. Well, that's a third up. That's what I mean. Yes, from here to here. Yeah, the yes. Same yes. Same. I see what you're saying. Yeah. So the intervals that you end, that you go up at two, you also go up at three. So we either think of the first note or the last note and go up a third. Yeah, the okay. end of two Let's do it a few times. We'll be, it's it's not, the end of three going into it isn't, it isn't terribly hard. Um, that's close enough. Shimmering, 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 Lots of lots, cause lots of lots, 
Let's try this. This is this is simple and fun, and you really need to have somebody that's next to you singing a different part. So we're all going to count up to three, and then we're going to restart at three from one to three. If you want to have someone next to you singing the same part, say the same number. So let's demonstrate. Abby. One. Two. Three. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Two. Okay. Two. Three. All right. So you got th three twos in a row. That's all right. Okay, so you're three. Three. One. Three. You were one, right? Two. Three. One. Two. One. Oh, you should be three. Three. Two. Okay. All right. The hard part is this. Here's the test. All the ones, raise your hand. <laughs> That's how you figure out what number you are. All the twos. Okay, it's pretty good, and all the, the rest of us are threes. Okay, so we're going to do unison, and then ones, then twos, then threes, and then we'll end somehow. I have no idea. No, we're, we're doing repeats. What? Repeat. So you do yes. repeat, yes. Repeat. That's just because there's a second ending on the third line. Sorry, so. what? Are we doing this in a different key? Yeah. We're doing C. It's C, that's too low. Oh, maybe not. Cause... I think that's what I started with. Yeah. Lots. Yeah, that's what so I started with. So do it up the after or lower, depending on how Okay, so, and. Lots of latkes, lots of latkes, lots of latkes, lots. Let's all eat them up. Lots of latkes, lots of latkes, lots of latkes, lots. Let's all eat them up. Sibi bon so so, 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 macabre.
how it goes. So why don't we divide into three sections and other sections, when you come in, you're good, and the others are going to have to depend on you coming in on time. And I'm probably not very clear, but we'll figure it out. Debbie, yes. Can we just sing the same part again and again? No, you're going to do each, you'll start with the snowfalls, then you're going to come in on the second one, we sing a spirit. So at the end, we don't sing the snowfalls, we sing we Correct. the second Correct. Everybody advances. Everybody advances. So you start with the snowfalls, then you do We Sing of Spirit, and then Peace Like a River, and then you go back up to the top again. Okay? So. How many times do you go through it? Until I get tired of hearing it. Uh, it sounds beautiful, huh? Once. Yeah. Huh? Never mind. Never mind. Okay, let's do. And we ignore the repeat signs. Ignore the repeat signs. Yeah. Yes. Oh, ignore that was going in. Yeah. We'll do a unison once, and then we'll have part one. Have that up for you. And part two. You're a part two. And then you three are part three, and you guys are part three. Oh, wait. So we're three? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, all right, together and together and then one, two, three. The snowfalls like the lashes sparkling with silver. Our voices lift into the air on clouds of light. We sing a song of cheer with all who gather here on this the shortest day, the longest night. We sing of spirit, sing of hope. We call each one to shine. We bind by ribbon, bell, and song our people to an older tongue. The snowfalls peace like a river to all lands will flow. We sing Gloria in excelsis Sparkling with silver, our voices lift into the air on clouds of light. We sing a song of cheer with all who gather here on this the shortest day, the longest night. The snowball sign flashes sparkling with silver, our voices lift into the air on clouds of light. We sing a song of cheer.
me. Give it up for our host, John Hetland. Who are we doing now? We're doing Hetland? Kogler? Kogler. Good grace. 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 Good that's the cheese from the cheese shop. Now you saw the Wesleydale over on the counter. Wesleydale, yes. Wesleydale. Oh my gosh. I didn't know there was going to be Wesleydale here. Wesley. Wesley. Serendipity. Wesley. Oh, Wesleydale. Whatever. Wow. And you know how it ends. Okay. I'm sorry. I'll have to shoot you. Everybody. No violence. Only cellos. Ah. Ah. So let me try to sing it once, and then you sing it with me. What about sax? Here's an F. You do that pitch. Good year, good air, good Wensleydale, good damson, good venison, and crackling good quail, good food, good wine. Good God, let's die. Good feel. Okay. okay. Good feel, good air, good Wednesday day, good dancing, good venison, good crackling, good bread, good food, good wine, good God, let's die. Okay, let's look at the second. Good damn son. Let's do the third middle line. Good damn son. Good venison. Some crack and good quail. Just sing it alone, John. I'm John. Thank you. Good damn son. Good venison. Some crackling, good quail. Do oh, that. Cracking, cracking, cracking. Cracking, okay. Cracking, cracking, okay. cracking, okay. cracking good. Okay. You're making that an E flat good. on venison, even though. <coughs> what? The E, the first venison. First ven. It's that's on an E. Are we making that? You're singing it as an E flat. Is that how we should be doing? No, because no. two, two seconds later, it is an E flat. If I'm singing it as an E flat, I'm wrong. Well, it's tricky to sing it as an E natural, I'll tell you that. Okay. Which is that. why they made an E flat in okay. down the measure. I'll sing it against the Good dancing, good venison. Okay, good dancing, good venison. Yes, you know the do you want me to sing the notes that are written? I guess. Yeah. Good Every other one. Good dancing, good. I don't know. Um, that's not right. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Let me get in the mode here. Good dancing, yes. good dancing, yes. good dancing, good dancing. Good Now that I know it, let me sing it once for <laughs> And then you sing it. Good dancing, good venison, some cracking good quail. Good dancing, good venison, some cracking good
Some crackling, 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 crackling,
Before, before, we, before, before we move on, I just want to make one announcement. Sorry. I want to make one announcement. Um, our next rounds group meeting, our next rounds party, will be February 7th. This will be the menu. Yeah. No. You're all. You yeah. all have to bring. I'm not you all have, have to bring something. So, all right. That was my little well, joke. Change the vowels. It was change very, the very little joke. Change the vowels. Sure and Sam, so make it do something. Because. because <laughs> Did you hear that? Instead of dancing, we'll have dim song. Dim song. Change the vowels. Oh, I like that. What I said? Change the vowels in damson and make it dim song. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. Yeah. If it's the menu. Year, new year. Wait, wait, can't keep it yeah. because we're going to the other side. Okay, 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 turn it over. Turn it over. Oh. Okay. This is by Nick Hume, who has been to the Rollins Gallery at least once. Actually, let me let me cue this up. Oh, I, let me try to change the list. Well, the last one is. No, it isn't. <laughs> Over her. Yes, it is. No, let, me, it is. let me try. Me wrong. If I can't sing the last line, then you can play it. No, I'm talking about everyone else. <laughs> Go on. Let's <laughs> start Okay. I will attempt to sing this first, and then and then when I fail, Murray will play it on his own. It's not you. It's us singing along with it. I could have walked. I could have walked for all the time the subway's taking. I could have walked, I could have friggin' walked. It's just less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street. I could have friggin' walked, and if I had, I'd be there now. I could have walked, I could have walked. For all the time the subway's taking, I could have walked, I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street. I could have friggin' walked. I'd be there. Wouldn't it be great to just break into song like this in the subway? Oh, wow, what fun! Well, somebody broke into song, at least in the words. That's true. This was overheard on the 7th Avenue. Low I think I said this. I think it was me. <laughs> <laughs> you probably got credit for the Everybody. lyrics. So, John, let me try and sing it once more, and you listen this time. Okay. <laughs> I could have walked. I could have walked. For all the time the subway's taking. I could have walked, I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street. I could have friggin' walked, and if I had, I'd be there now. So I could have walked, I could have walked, for all the time the subway's taking. I could have walked, I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street. I could have friggin' walked, and if I had, I'd be there now. I could have walked, I could have walked for all the time the subway's taking. I could have walked, I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street. I could have friggin' walked, and if I had, I'd be there now. Okay, some of you have it. <laughs> and some of you Some of us have it. Some of us are blustering along. And some of us are remembering it wrong. Yeah. Uh, John, if I could. What I did is I recorded just, it's less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street a bunch of times, and some people could sing along with that. With your permission? Just up to 14th Street? It's less than a mile 23rd. to the end. Mm -hmm. oh, for, okay. from the, just the starting from the middle? It's, a lead, it's the lead into the hard part. Okay, hum along with the machine. It's less than a mile right. Right. So, here. It's less. Sorry. That was bad.
start again. It's less than a mile from passation to 14th Street in a perfect heart. And if I had, I'd be there. Now you. It's less than a mile from passation to 14th Street in a perfect heart. And if I had, I'd be there. Sing along. Let me start again. Let me start again. Yeah. Okay. So it's less. Yeah, I'm starting with it's less. Okay. That's a lead into the hard. At the beginning. I'm. It's just it's rehearsing a... the hard part. Go ahead. The okay. beginning is very easy. Got it. So. It's less than a mile from the station to 14th Street. I could have freaking walked, and if I had. For the others, but I'll try and make it clear, uh, uh, or something like that. Not go like that. When you see me go like that, just when you get to the next fermata, stop. <laughs> so, unison, and then. Mm -hmm. I could have walked. I could have walked for all the time the subway's taking. I could have walked. I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from Penn Station to 14th Street. I could have friggin' walked, and if I had, I'd be there now. I could have walked. I could have walked for all the time the subway's taking. I could have walked. I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from the sun's station. I could have walked. I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from the sun's station. I could have walked. I could have friggin' walked. It's less than a mile from the sun's station. I could have walked. I could have friggin' walked. 
go back to the well, Somebody's bogarting it out there. They don't come up here and share. <laughs> well, we're getting the. Okay. So, something non denominational. Some of you wished us a happy winter solstice. John, are we going to hear one of yours? Later. Yep. We will. Yep, yep, yep. We missed that last time. It's fine. No, I don't know. You must come more often. Okay, this is by Sky Evergreen. I want I want to be I want to know someone whose name is Sky. I assume he's did you say pine tree or sure? Evergreen? Yeah, she comes to the music. What? Oh. Yeah, she. she Sky Evergreen, pine tree? Do you know who Sky Evergreen is? No. Yeah. Let's go to John's. Let's go to John's. Please go to John's. Let's go to John's. Let's go to John's. It's okay. Burn them. Let's see. 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 I'm going to lower it to a C so we don't have to sing a high D. Now is the longest night of winter. Everyone. Now is the longest night of winter. Okay, we can just sing through. Okay. Now is the longest night of winter. When all and the the should not be there, it should be under the <laughs> second note. You see that? Yes. Okay. okay. Just yeah. Yes. All oh, okay. okay. So all, all the worlds. Uh, so the uh, the 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 goes under the second note. Okay. Good. Now and now is the longest night of winter. It's an octave. The, it's don't rest. No rest for the weary. The sun, the sun's return. Sing farewell to all we knew. Bring out the old, bring in the new. Okay, that's better. Okay, so um, usually what you do, uh, the word the, if, if the word that follows it, it, it starts with a, a vowel, you say the, the old, but bring in the new. So it's nice when we're all on the same valve, whatever part you're singing. After wait, is there a, a pause for the rest? It's oh, true. The after, after the wait, yeah, wait. wait. That's the only rest in the whole thing. Yeah. Bring in the new. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Uh, now, let's do one more. Uh, so this is five parts. There's a lot of parts. Uh, this is, what, what did we do before for five parts? I Choose just your own. grouped them. Okay. Go back to it. Same group. I was one. You're one. Who were these ones? These were the ones. Okay. Ones. No, we were. They're the what, ones. Were you, were you spread out? Oh, I was here. Spread out one. I was here. Yeah, this was five. Oh, this yeah, counts this off? Was, you were five. No, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. no, they were one, not me. Okay, I'm so, five. One, <laughs> two, three. Oh, wait a minute. That's my time. One, two, three, four, five. So let's do it in unison, Curtis. Okay? You're all okay you're all okay with it, right? You listen to that one? And now is the longest night of winter.
So we recently befriended somebody who has, uh, or Evie has recently befriended somebody who has written a lot of the things that we've done over the years. And she actually met Jonathan Jensen this past year. He's the uh, principal bassist or something like that for the Baltimore Symphony. Yeah, he, he, he does play bass for the Baltimore Symphony Orchestra. And I happen to be making a trip to Baltimore and having never met him, but having so many friends in common, I said, can we meet up? Ended up meeting with him and his wife at a restaurant near the Symphony Hall, and we sang in the back of the restaurant. We sang around. <laughs> but he's very clever. I love his stuff. You know, he's done the kitty round. He's done desecration. <laughs> did he, is he the one who did the song after his mother died? Oh. Teach us how to to sing with you. I don't think so. I don't. I don't know. It made sense in the round. All right. Who needs? Everybody got? There we go. Okay. So. Um, I don't know, he, this was going to be a two-part series of a men's edition and a women's edition. I think the, the reason it's men is because the, um, the individuals indicated are all male singers. So maybe we'll, have, um, maybe we'll have Beyonce in the next round. I don't know. John, wherever you are. Well, God, tell him. He has to write one. Have to write one. Yeah, so yeah, you could tell that's him. his intention. Okay, so uh, Randy, played, Randy played this on the piano to help us because the, the timing is a little. Oh, it's not hard. And Murray, what was your instrument? Boys, the piano. Oh, oh. harpsichord. Midi, Other midi sound. file. Midi. Yeah. That was a midi, midi sound. Oh, well, what was the instrument? So no. this was what this no, was John. No, the use that you midi take. file. This was John. Midi. John, John, John created the midi. It's a midi file. It's uh -huh. a midi file. It's a musical it's a making, sound having an instrument at all. Making a sort um, of no, sorry, I don't have, I don't have this. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, here we go. So this is called a piano. <laughs> <laughs> All-star round, floor by third. Okay. All star round, floor by third. Calypso moves and the fourth rocket. Yeah, well, so 
Whatever. <laughs> I just wanted to, you don't have to snap through the whole thing. This is, this is for the high school performance edition. <laughs> Please. Okay. Um, so, let's start, um, let's have you guys start Frank Sinatra, and then you guys come in Frank Sinatra afterwards. And then, uh, let's see, that's, yeah, okay, so there'll be three, and then you guys will be four. I, I, I guess you get one. All right, hold on. <laughs> Let's do this you again. Okay, so you four so will be the first what, what part. What about us? What about us? Are we gonna You'll be the fourth part. Then? You'll come in. We'll be four? You'll be okay. there. Okay. So then your part two-ish. Yeah, I'm not sure which way. But then three, and then four. Very okay. Oh, yeah, okay. We have a big four. Okay, so let's all okay. together. <laughs> Frank Sinatra and Fra Frank Sinatra, Frank Sinatra, Frank Sinatra, ring a ding ding, Luciano Pavarotti, Nessandorma, Harry Belafonte, Harry Belafonte, Harry Belafonte. Okay, listen. 
listen. If wishes were horses, beggars would ride. So take care what you wish for, then take it in stride. If wishes were horses, beggars would ride. It's easier than you think. <laughs> if wishes were, if wishes were, if wishes were, if wishes beggars would Yeah, get that beggars, yeah. Beggars would ride. Yeah, do that much if wishes were.
over here, group two for here, group three here, and group four love wages. Okay, what's in unison? And then? I never wish for a horse. We'll, we'll get a new pitch. Oh, I never wish, okay. I never wish for a horse, of course. My wishes were more mundane. I wish I had not made a stupid remark and lay down to sleep in vain. I never wish for a horse, of course. My wishes are wish one day, of course. My wishes are wish for a stupid people. My wishes are to see 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 a a horse, of course. I don't know. Oh, what, why did you I didn't write about Too long ago. No way. I, I have written something <laughs> so, on this text. Soul Weber, as you know. Wait a minute, Murray. Oh, sorry. Before we use the I had written a quartet on the It Wishes for Horses, and John decided to riff on that text and make two rounds for Oh, so we can put it in the next story. Yeah. All right. I'm not asking you to sing the quartet. That's a horse of a different color. Yeah. Oh. So, uh, Saul, Saul, as you know, uh, did a lot of very humorous things at, at various festivals and things like that. And one thing that he did, which uh, we borrowed and brought to uh, a folk dance camp in California, we each had A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, M, N, O, P, Q, etc., etc. Et and then after no, we could... No, 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 It's a one-line joke. It's wonderful. So we're doing something called Noel. There's a Debbie? lot of copies there. Debbie, dear. Okay. Anybody else? That's the are good. Nice you are. Oh, I keep having okay. more of these. Okay, let me start this up. No, we no, have a note that you okay. love that. Sing, no, 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 sing, no, no, sing, no, no, So it's minor. No, no, sing, no, no, sing, no, no, sing, no, 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 how's that? Sing. I think that'll be enough. That'll be enough even for bass twos. Okay. No, how sing. No, how sing. No, how sing. No. I don't feel free to go up and walk, but you, you may. Or right, so. if you start high, go up, whatever. All right, so let's do it. And no, sing, no, sing, no, sing, no.
so yeah. Okay. That's all. I'm saying sing. No. Dessert. But before we have that, 
We'll do it, Randy. You and I, we'll do it that way. Okay. Um, so, Saul always started off the announcements with little bits of humor, corny humor. I just want to let you know. It's offensive. It grieves me as much as it grieves you to have to read these to you. Yeah. <laughs> so. Oh, no. Good how, how offensive is it? A good scale of one to ten. We'll do offensive. We'll have a vote no. after. Well, you know what bird, what these, bird can... These are, these are, we don't need any more. We don't need any more. <laughs> and win! Oh, right. oh. So, we're in an asylum, and you see the inmates, and one guy is counting... 13, 13, 13, a passerby, oh, curious peeks through the hole and is poked in the eye. He goes, 14, 14. <laughs> so oh, too good, so right? Bad. So a bartender says to Descartes, would you like to have another beer? And Descartes says, I think not, and he disappears. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? Guy Brian Descartes. Descartes. These are quick. Oh, these, are, these, are, these are quick. These are quick. You'll have to listen to the recording. <laughs> guy gives birth to twins. He's very angry. Uh, uh, guy's wife gives birth to twins. He's very angry. He grabs a gun and he goes out looking for the other man. Oh. What's the difference between a drunk and an alcoholic? An alcoholic has to go to all those damn meetings. <laughs> I met I met Mrs. Wright, Miss Wright, but I didn't realize that her last name was always. <laughs> now you know. Okay, so Randy and I went to uh, Lancaster. Uh, this Lancaster is not a joke. this past uh, this <laughs> past uh, fall. Right. We That's went to Lancaster. That's and Murray we saw, and Mrs. Always Right. Uh -huh. Mrs. Always Right. Oh, yes. We went to and so we were in the Amish country and we saw this woman that uh, was uh, had a buggy and the and the horse was pulling the buggy and uh, the cop pulls her over because she was going really fast, and we see that the reins were going around the horse's testicles. And uh, so the cop goes over to the, to the buggy driver and says, what's that for? He says, oh, that's the emergency brake. <laughs> all right, so I stole that's it. Before, it's all over. It's all over. You can now relax. You can breathe <laughs> out. <laughs> breathe in. So first of all, again, I want to thank John for hosting Don't you feel sorry for me again? This is the not season. No, not yet, not yet, not yet. This is the season of um, of being thankful and uh, for friends and family. And I and Randy want to express, and Evie too, I'm sure, want to express our thanks for all of you for coming to these years in and years out. Um, it really gives us a lot of pleasure to sing with all of you. And please let your friends know that occasionally there's a good joke. <laughs> Once in a while, and we have some occasionally. Not tonight, but still waiting. Still waiting. Occasionally, still waiting. occasionally, occasionally, occasionally we have some good, good, uh, good uh, harmony, and uh, we have rounds that we get to express. That uh, it's really, a, it's a wonderful thing to share. Uh, there are many of these groups around the nation, and uh, Saul was Saul was considered to be the round man for for many good reasons. I mean, he collected them more than anybody else, and uh, if you ever went to his basement, you would recognize. He does have, he did have more rounds than anybody else on earth. And so we're, over the next few years, we're going to try to get through a, a good fraction of them. And we thank all the people that create new ones and uh, add to this. And it's really Barbara and John, beyond looking at you, and I'm looking at Brian. Um, so again, this is the season to thank, and so I really appreciate all of you coming. Um, so well, never, other announcements. Never apologize for the Another, jokes. another, yeah. uh, other announcements of things uh, to come? Yes, um, for those Just who are new time. here, um, I am the producer of three CDs of rounds. Um, for people who learn a little more easily by ear, rather than the paper train. And so if anyone's interested in a rounds album where you can learn the rounds and you can sing along, we've left parts out for people to sing along. Um, I have them over there on the table. Um, and great, say, great stocking stuffers. And I want to say, here. and I want to say that working, <laughs> working with Evie and singing in the studio with with great people uh, was one of the most pleasurable experiences I've ever had in my life. And I really thank Evie for doing that. Yes. The third album we sang with a number of the rounds composers, those who were alive, um, and not those who were dead. Not those who were dead. <laughs> Oh, thank God. Some have died since. I saw Darrow. Please pass these around. This is, this is one of my, one of my favorite rounds. That was 
good. What was the joke? Good. No, okay, no repeating. Okay, please pass these around. Um, oh. Now, somebody told me afterwards that um, they, they're a, a teacher of English as a second language. And she said she played uh, one of the rounds recordings for her class and asked them which round they'd like to learn. And they picked this one because it has some really beautiful sentiments. So, okay. All right. So I'll do the first line and then you will no, sing it. Just put them on the chair. Home, home is the place where somebody loves me. I'm going there with me. Home is the place where somebody loves me. We'll take the extra. I'm going there. The next line. Home is the same old streets and people yet. I know they care with me. Home is the same old streets and people yet. I know they care. I've traveled far and I will travel more, but my heart longs for my own front door I travel. studio, every time we got to, but, you would hear Saul go, but. but. So if you listen to the recording and you hear that, that's, that's him. That's him. Home, once more in unison, and. Home is the place where somebody loves me. I'm going there. Home is the same old streets and people yet. I know they care. I travel far, and I will travel more. But my heart longs for my own front door. Home is the place where somebody loves me. I'm going there.
third great rounds after dessert. Yay! So uh, we 15 will fifteen minutes. Take the desserts from that little table in the back and put them out in the center. There's the rounds up. Unless you want the back, we'll keep them. Choice. Thank you. Yeah, we'll move it. Yeah. What is this? Oh, that's right, Jill. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And Rebecca. Oh. Yeah. Right. Cool. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Take some of CDs. Take some of every CDs. Thank you.
fascinating about this is we recorded it, and when you listen to it, it starts this reverberation. Yeah. There is something about this round, and it's like, it starts to go like this. So, can we do it once more? Oh, sure. And just listen to see if that starts happening. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. You ought to be a good tune. Mm -hmm. Did Haydn write it as a round? Huh? It's, Did Haydn write it as a round? Unclear. Unclear. <laughs> okay, part one. Though my soul may set in darkness, though my eyes in certain darkness, though my soul may set in darkness, it will rise in Blas und krank. Sei doch kein Muselmann, der ihn nicht lassen kann. So a lot it's of us know, know the music, yeah, but not your German words. Yeah. It's politically probably not correct these days, but I didn't hear anybody. I heard people uh, profess Judaism and Christianity, but nobody professed uh, Muslim being a Muslim. So. So what does this mean? Okay. Um, Listen, please. The, the translation would be C-O-F-F-E-E -E, uh, Don't drink so much coffee. Um, not for children uh, is the Turkish drink. Um, let's see. Oh, Schwächtisch uh, Schwäch die Nerven, mach dich blass und krank. Um, it it weakens you. your nerves and makes Thank you, you um, a pale and, and sick. Sick. Pale and sick. Uh, next line is, sei doch kein Muselmann. Don't be a Muslim, der ihn nicht lassen kann, who, who cannot 
uh, be without this drink. Oh, <laughs> right, because they can't drink. They can't who, drink caffeine. Who, who can't caffeine? who can't be without coffee? What's about? I don't know. No, no, no. Latter Day Saints. Oh wait, that's so the Latter Day Saints. Alcohol. Latter Day Saints. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> yes. so the don't, Germans got it wrong. Don't be a Muslim no, who, who can't, can't be without the don't coffee. Don't drink so much. Yeah. Okay. Lawrence, what's your? I'm going to write down here. Learn from you. What's your last name? Norton. How do you spell it? Oh, later. Okay. No A C E R. Oh, Norton. I thought you said Norton. That's what uh, I said. Then she said later. So it's. Oh. Uh, I, I tried. <laughs> I, just try. Just try to get through this. <laughs> okay, here's you. Some, of, some of us know this, so we can sing it with you if you'd like. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. What's our starting note? Say, that's too Is that too low? Much too low. And I'm an alto. Say, Sing time. syllables if you want, or yeah, sing da da da. We'll drop anyway, so we'll start there. Right? We'll yeah. drop. Could, could I give a pitch and then we do that? Yeah, yeah maybe give a B flat. That's a real C. Yeah, I know. You want a B flat? Okay. It's not, it's not too hard. Hey, oh, there. Okay, we'll do it at tone low. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Say, oh, Oh, I see. On the second line? Yeah. 
Yeah. Do you see? What, let me show you. It's not a dot in eight. In the pink book, which Do you see seen. this? Yeah. Right here? It, there's a dot over there. Oh. It's a smudge. Yeah. It doesn't make any sense to be there. No, no. So I'm ignoring it. What, Gerald? All right, let's do it, please. Let's please yes. do it. I've got a lot more yeah. rounds that I want to do tonight. Anyway. It's, yeah, it's, it's not a dot. It's not a dot. It's that something dot on the... Let's do it. Just divide us up somehow. Okay, how about group one be, um, um, oh, there's nobody here. <laughs> <laughs> We're invisible. No. Nope. Well, let's count off. One, two, three. One, two, three. Count. Skip me. Ah. Two, two. Oh, three. Skip me. I can't Skip do this. Two. Two. Yeah. Oh, obviously, la, la, la. la, la. Are you skipping two? I'm right. skipping. I'm it's being the two. words. If it's the words, just do la, la, la. Just do la, la, la. Three. One. Two. Two. Three. three. One. We're done. Okay, all ones. Raise your hand. All twos. You just maybe I'm one. Okay, I'm one. Yeah, I'm three. I'll be three. Who are the ones? Right, in unison, one. Oh, I'm not being the only one. I'm one. Because <laughs> I don't know these words. In unison. I do. Peasley. I learned different words. I need a, I need a yay there. May I? I learned yay! yay! Okay, good. That was better. Okay, so this is the Burger King Blues. Yeah. Richard Peasley is someone who uh, Peter Shickley sang with, and Peter Shickley wrote a very clever round where it says, I'd like to sing a Peasley's. We never fool around with warming up. We just get down to the singing. <laughs> And this is by Richard Peasley, who's got a very long uh, bio, having written for many musicals and things like that. So you can look them up at some point. May, may I just say one thing about the last round? Um, I, I learned it in 1958. Hmm. So it's older than that, because oh, it is our old. German teacher taught it to us then. Oh yeah, no, it's 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 probably uh, 19th century. Oh, okay. I mean, it's it is a, it's an exquisitely. I need that. Okay, so we have um, so Randy. So the words are drove through a suburb of New Orleans. Oh, so cool in my Chevy Malibu. Could not find a McDonald's in town. I'm feeling so sad. I've got the Burger King blues. I'm the Burger King. So. Um, <laughs> I don't know, we couldn't figure out, we don't have Richard Peasley to ask, why he's got the Burger King blues, because he can't get to McDonald's. Because he has to eat Burger King. Yeah. Yeah, but. All right, anyway, so here's, here it is by the piano. Burger King blues, Richard Peasley. Oh, so 
I know where he got the first six notes. Rearrange your life. Yeah, right, right, right. That's it. Okay. Um, John, yes, I love that the first time I ever saw it. And then I held the tape recorder up to the TV. Someone posted it right. from our audience, and I wrote that. Let's do uh, Goldstein's uh, Christmas. Okay. Oh, here's an easy one. Wait, we just... Let's do oh. Thanks, Cal. Oh, thank you. Yeah. This one we've been, we have prepared for well, like a million years. Millions and millions of times. We never got around to it, never got around to it, never got around to it. This is super, super simple. to 
the rounds group, short guy, bald head, and he wrote one that I know. Did he write oh. a lot of limericks? Not that David I, Goldstein? Not that I, I don't know, know of. Yeah, he wrote a, if live, if what, well, if, if, Singing, oh. singing's your joy and delight, but triple time gets you a tie. Perhaps on the whole of the squeaky meal will make the music come on. That's right. David. That's the David. <laughs> oh my gosh! My where God. is that? We I mean, don't have a copy of that. that? <laughs> I have it that somewhere. Again? Okay, well, I, I, I remember him funny. for writing. No. If it's the same one, yes, for writing it's limericks. Be. That's funny. John, can you see that? That's again? funny. The one that I remember from him Oh, yeah. Is okay, you're going to record it, and then you'll send it to me? Oh, good. Oh, wait. Hold oh, my phone's not on. Everything's on. Up John, can you sing that again? Yeah, we have it here. Oh, right. Oh, my okay. phone's on. Okay, John's going to sing it again. One. Wait a minute, two, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, wait. Yeah, Turn on my voice recorder. Right. Okay. Yeah, singing's your joy and delight, but triple time gets you up tight. Perhaps on the whole a discreet hemiola will make the rhythm come out right. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Yay. Thanks, okay, so what is this called? <laughs> Perhaps. David Goldstein's hemiola. Perhaps. David Goldstein wrote the wrote the, the limerick and I wrote the music to it. Oh. Oh, this is a John Hedlund. Oh, it was a cooperative yes. venture, I guess. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, he wrote a lot of limericks. Oh, okay, we don't know any of them. All right, first note on this is B flat. Christmas is. What? Yes. Oh, I have a D. Is it the same thing we had? No, well, we changed the oh, okay. Morning, it's a morning, afternoon, we and okay. night. Christmas is not just another so day. Don't worry, Christmas, day. Is, Christmas, Christmas is not just another day with morning, afternoon, and night. Because that special star that shone delights it with a special light. Christmas is not just another day with morning, afternoon. Because that special star that shone still lights it with the special Sorry. Let's do the second line. Because that special star that shone still lights it with the special light. Christmas is not just another day with morning, afternoon, and night. Because that special star that shone to light with the special light. So the thing that I'm not doing properly is Christmas is not just a not just another day. So this is a this is a major huh, major major then a minor. So that's what's cool about this, but I'm not so, it's hard for me to continue to do that. This is a da da major minor morning, afternoon, and night. Because that special star that shone still lights it with the special light. Christmas is not just another day with morning, afternoon, and night. Because that special sun that shone still lights it with the special light. So he doesn't Christmas. say where's the, how many parts it is. It's two. Okay. There's a top, there's oh, a oh, one, one top and there's a two. two. Top That's top how many bottom. parts there are. Top and bottom, yes. <laughs> Got it. All right. Um, so how about, mm, mind splitting? How about men and women? Um, we haven't done that all It's right. almost equal. All right. We'll do men and women. Fine. <laughs> Okay, so women first, and Christmas is not just another day with morning, afternoon, and night. Because of special song that chants with lights in the special night. Because of special song that shows delight. Morning, afternoon, and night. 
Just one more? One more with just this last one. Oh, it is? Oh, okay. The two of you. John, here. Okay, first note was a D. Slowly. Yes, yeah, we yeah. are going to do it. Still we were just, as the seed. We were it has just to be done tenderly, it says. Deep That's one more than time to leave. Still as a seed. 